welcome back to my channel today i am bringing you all another weekly vlog so today it is actually a monday and as some of you may know i do work mondays and tuesdays yeah, those two days are in my contracted days at in my kind of main job in a way if that's what i like to call it i'm not quite sure um so i woke up at like around half eight and like I have a breakfast, so I went in the shower and did my makeup. I actually do need to straighten my hair because I did wash and blow dry it. However, it can sometimes go wavy after like I blow dried it. And obviously like I want to have my hair straight and stuff. Um, so I am going to probably straighten it before I go because I will be leaving in like 20 minutes. But I'm really excited to vlog this morning. I don't know why. I think it's because it is a new week and after this week as well, it will be six weeks until Christmas. I have actually started my Christmas shopping and I'm kind of halfway there now. Um, so I'm pretty excited to be able to wrap them up soon. I've not bought any wrapping paper yet. I really like buying presents for other people and like at Christmas time, it's really exciting. And I'm actually going away over Christmas, I think as well now. So I was spending that with my family and I also think Scott is coming with us as well. So that is really exciting. So yeah, so I'm having quite a positive morning this morning. It's usually totally different for me for a Monday morning. Cause usually I am so moody and so tired, but it makes a, it makes a good change. Um, so yeah, so a new week, a new day, they're working away. So I was starting work at quarter to 12 and finished at five. So a five and a quarter shift. You may be thinking, why is it five hours and a quarter? It's because like I get a fifteen minute break, so like it's easier for them to calculate it up if I work a quarter like a quarter extra. So that, like it's it's just me working five hours. Does that make sense? I think it does. Um, but the lighting is actually terrible. I'm gonna straighten my hair. I've actually all the Christmas cards as well. I was on Me and Pig yesterday, and it was forty percent off cards. So I kind of ordered a family card. Yeah, the three other people in my family. And my mum, my dad, and my sister, and then I've also ordered one for Scott. But would you guys give Christmas cards before Christmas Day or on Christmas Day? Because I'm kind of thinking of maybe giving them on the first of December, maybe. I I'm not quite sure. I have to see. But yeah, I'm slowly starting to feel a bit festive. I also know it is very early, and people are probably going to be thinking, "Oh my God, like why I get excited over Christmas?" But I think it's because things are getting back to normal now um and it won't begin a lockdown such as year for christmas so yeah it's very exciting i am home now guys i finished work as well honestly i feel really tired and i've also dropped my little sister off at her netball thing that she goes to on a monday but honestly i'm actually exhausted my mum kind of printed off some more flyers for me because if you do not know it probably must most of you guys are probably going to know anyway, but I am um, currently working in a salon. Um, and I obviously need flyers printed out and everything else like that. You know, the joys of being self-employed, you've got to do everything yourself, pretty much. Um, so yeah, but I was going to show you something. Oh yeah, there's some photo frames I got from TK Maxx and Primark. I like buying some new kind of homey bits and stuff attach your room if you don't know my room is pink and gold so i like everything to kind of be like a pink and gold theme with the velvety material they're not crushed velvet i mean my light shade and my lamp shade is crushed velvet but that's like the only things i would have um but everything else is like the velvety like material for example this thing here and it's a chair here with all my clothes on at the moment so yeah, but I'm going to show you the photo frames I bought from Primark and TK Maxx because they're really pretty. Here are the frames from Primark. These were only a pound each. I got these in the Manchester one. I can't believe a pound. I was thinking these would be like three pounds. But yeah, um, a pound. So I got two of them and I actually made an order on free prints. It's basically like, a, like you can print off photos off there and like you just have to pay for like the shipping and stuff. So, because I like having photos in my room instead of always having them on your phone because I've had like a few you know, situations where 
and my phone's actually like deleted all my photos so i like to have i like to have all of my photos like you know printed out and like, i can have some in frames and stuff like it makes it more homely and this one from tk maxx the pink velvet and gold 4 99 it's obviously really good quality and it it matches that and that so pretty chuffed you know it's really nice um and as i said it's nice to have photos printed out i do have a little photo frame over there but yeah, my sister got me that a, a few years ago and it's got like a load of photos in there um just yes like, i don't know i think i'm maybe gonna have yeah, this one i'm not quite sure maybe on my bedside table that's like the main one and probably these like the one over there and maybe one over there maybe but yeah so that's what i've i've got here and also yeah, these fairy lights i got from primark three pounds as well who remembers when i used to have yeah, the like yeah, the pink roses fairy lights on there yeah, what happened was yeah, they broke in the end and like they all fell off and stuff but i want to kind of recreate it again and have yeah, these and these are like a lot classier and cute three pounds and yeah, three different colors like a dark pink a light pink and like a an orangey color and ten of them yeah, the primark in manchester was unbelievable for all like the home stuff like if if i wasn't uh, coming home on the train and like we you were in the car i probably would have got a lot more stuff but for now yeah, that's like the homey bits i got i'm also going to show you guys something else because it is something that a lot of you guys are going to love it's my diary <laughs> they're not very interesting as you guys can see from the box i've got something from dior you leave your guesses of what it is because i'm i'm pretty sure like a lot of people are going to guess but yeah, the box is really cute i was going to save this for like a designer haul however i'm trying to save in my pennies for christmas time and also like i'm buying a lot of christmas presents well i'm i'm kind of halfway there with christmas presents but i want to buy them all before i buy anything for myself um so i'm just going to show you what is in here it comes like a little dust bag how cute is that i basically got right it is quite hard to take out of the box wait a minute right i basically have a little makeup bag because i needed an upgrade i'm not gonna lie i do have like a little ted baker one and it is beautiful it's perfect for like all my brushes and stuff but it can get a bit cramped in there sometimes if like my settings for and stuff and like if i add more stuff in also got a new eyeshadow palette in morphe james charles it was like a nine pound 80 in the morphe shop if you heard the story of me trying to order it on morphe it what happened was i ordered it and it was half price it was 10 pounds um and i had to pay for shipping as well five pounds shipping can i just add five pounds shipping like that is extortionate and it never arrived and they issued me a refund so i never order off morphe because like the stuff never arrives it's really bad so i decided to order this gorgeous christian dior makeup bag because i love having a more expensive type makeup bags because they do last longer and the ted baker one i've had for absolutely ages now um it's really hard to open things on camera but here it is it's just got like a zip up there the focus is so bad because i'm vlogging on my phone the joy of vlogging on phones um and then the inside oh my god why is it so uh, i suppose it's black so there's the zip and then yeah, the inside i think it's got like a little pouch in there a velvety material so really easy to clean and stuff inside but yeah this is a little makeup bag i'm going to be going and having in my tea now because i'm starving i think we're having lasagna so i am honestly excited also the phone storage on my phone is actually full up so I'm going to have to export all, all the footage onto my laptop and then edit it. So I do have a lot on my hands right now. The new fairy lights are up from Primark. How cute are these? I've just attached them with blue tack for now because I don't actually have like any white tack or anything else to put them on with. But how cute are them? I might have to move them up slightly because in this end it's more like a bear compared to that end. But I love them so much and like it adds a bit of like... It makes it feel more Christmas if these up. They're only three pounds and they're so nice. Yeah, I'm mean, happy with them. So that is like a new kind of feature to my room this week. How cute. I love them. It is a new day and as you can tell, I look horrendous. I'm going to be putting some makeup on because I'm going to work soon. And also, I've got two massive spots on my cheek. This one actually had a really big whitehead like 
on the spot and like it was hanging out so like, i squeezed it and like all the pus and stuff inside of it squeezed out of it it was kind of satisfying and disgusting at the same time and this one is just like still really big um i did actually put some spot paste on them so like it has it has kind of dried them out a bit and hopefully it'll kind of die them down now but yes i'm going to put some makeup on because i need to be looking more awake right now i'm also it won't just sink out again it because as you probably know by now i live in my dressing gown it's so comfortable i literally wear it all the time it does get covered in makeup because whenever like, i do my makeup i always wear this it's kind of keep me warm and stuff and cozy i've done my face now i look like i don't have any lips because like i've not put any lipstick on because i have put the oven on for my lunch um i'll be having like an early lunch again because obviously like i don't get a proper lunch break at my work because like, i only work for five hours also in my hands yes it looks like tiger bread i need to really exfoliate it off i'm home now everybody from work honestly it was such a long shift today i am actually happy to be home um in my makeup stayed on pretty well but i actually got a couple of things from moon pig um i think i actually ordered the christmas cards last night and they've arrived this morning however in moon pig do it send things first class so it's really good so i'm going to show you what kind of cards i got I got a Christmas card for like my whole family and then a Christmas card for Scott. I'll probably give them them on the 1st of December. So yes, also I walked in the house and it literally smelled of curry and I, I'm obsessed with like chicken curry and stuff. I'm not really like a spicy curry person. The only type of ones I can have is a korma and also a tikka masala but it was really nice i mean it does smell really nice and they are my favorites so yeah but i'm going to open these cards and kind of show you which ones i never actually get a christmas card this early however when i went on to moon pig it was actually 40 percent off all christmas cards so i thought well i like to say myself i think it was still five pounds but that was including first class postage so to be honest it isn't too bad because moon pig cards are always really good quality anyway um so yeah but I'm gonna open these and show you them. Here is mine and Scott's Christmas card. We both love this photo, and it was actually in a photo booth at one of the restaurants in Manchester. And you know, Christmas love from your aunt. Like, it just has like all the writing inside. So that's like a really cute a Christmas. Yeah, that one is like a really cute a Christmassy one. Then I'm just gonna open this one. Honestly, open envelopes on camera is so awkward. But if we're gonna try it and attempt it today. So then we have this one, so like I'm gonna explain. This is like a baby photo of me. It's like a normal photo of my mum. In that photo, it was like a weird photo of my dad, and then it had a picture of my sister sleeping. And I was going to put you know, my sister's name on there, but I completely forgot, but it's fine. I mean, she, I don't I think she's really gonna cry about it, but yeah, and that's just got like all right inside. It's so for like £2 each, I don't. I think it's too bad because they're really good quality cards. Um, this one is really funny. The other wax pot is also on because I am going to wax my underarms. They're kind of like it's disgusting, but yeah, they really need wax. Um, I usually wax them like every a week and a half to two weeks because my hair growth cycle is so quick, it really needs done. Also, I'm in my PJs, they're not going out it's my kind of vibe right now the plan for the rest of the week tomorrow i will be seeing scott and we're actually going to be filming a video i need to buy like a few bits for it maybe if you guess it's down below um it'll probably be up after this weekly vlog or maybe before i'm not too sure yet um and then also on friday i am going for like a meal with my friend and my sister it's just both of our friend um and like you've not seen her in like a while so it could be nice to like you go for a meal and you're actually going to in the meantime it's like a little restaurant in carlisle i've never been before so that's booked for tea time so i'm very excited to go and get dressed up at least i'll be out of the house for some part of the vlog anyway but yeah i'm gonna probably light my candle after tea probably because my tea will be ready very soon also fairy lights are gonna be on wait oh yeah up there how cute are they it's wednesday now everybody and I've got a full face of makeup on. I'm about to go out because me, my mum, and 
Yeah, my grandma are going out for lunch at this place called The Last Zebra in Carlisle. We've been there before and it's really nice with food and drinks and stuff. But like, I won't be drinking because it's like lunchtime, you know what I mean? But you know, the table is booked for half twelve and me and my mother are going to walk down because we might as well. Um, it gets some exercise and some fresh air and stuff. So I'm actually wearing you know, my Burberry jacket. Uh, not Burberry jacket, a Burberry scarf and my H&M jacket. And then I'm going to show you the rest of my outfit and everything because it's a really cute outfit today. Outfit of the day, as, as I've already told you, scarf and jacket, a Louis Vuitton handbag, some of the pool collection. I then also have on in my little cardigan, a burgundy colour. I got this off Scott for my birthday and then like a white a PLT bodysuit under that and then a black River Island pants. So that is my outfit today. I really wanted to take your little beauty out because um, I never really take her out as much. So she's going on like a little trip with me today. She's so pretty. I love her so much. Also, yes, I have like primer packs and stuff. Also, a parcel arrived for Scott for Christmas. These are his chocolates I'm getting for Christmas. I've also got him a t-shirt for Christmas. So that is that really so yeah i'm gonna be setting off soon i've also done my makeup so like i'm all dolled up now as you can tell probably yeah but yeah i'm ready to go because i'm pretty hungry i did finish work at like 20 past 10 today and i got in at around um 25 to 11 here and then i had like a little muffin before i did my makeup and i also put some screen wash in the car because it was running low and they also checked the tyre pressure so I'm pretty much now a car <laughs> a car person <laughs> you literally don't have a clue about a car to really but it's handy to know that information but anyway yeah in my room it's currently a tip oh my god it's actually embarrassing this is it oh my god yeah I hardly got any sleep as well last night because I think because I was having to get up at four o'clock. I think yeah, my body couldn't fully relax. And, like I kept waking up every hour, but I managed to get like a bit of sleep. But like it's, it's not the best when you're waking up every hour and like you want the time to go quickly. But I don't feel I don't feel too tired at the moment. I probably will do later. I might be seeing Scott later as well, possibly. I was thinking of I was thinking of filming a video. However, I might have to film it next week now because I've got. A lot of stuff going on now anyway but yeah i'm gonna go click like, yeah i need to go i've just got home everybody i had a lovely meal with my mum and in my grandma i did actually have a spill milk chicken burger and it was really nice however i have been doing some christmas shopping which means expensive time for me and my mum i actually managed to get some christmas presents for my two grandmas my mum, um, who else? Scott as well. Um, so I got a few bits from Boots from my grandma's and my mum, and also something from Lush for Scott. I'm not going to actually show anything on this vlog, just in case any of them are watching them. And then for Scott, I managed to get a few things from TK Maxx, so I'm gonna put them all away. Scott is actually downstairs, he's actually talking to my mum about Christmas presents because to be honest, I will budget on each other's I will budget it for each other this year was gonna be 150 because last year it was 250 and it we got each other quite a lot of things but you want to lower it yeah, this year because it's our because it is our second Christmas together so there's no need to spend like a lot and lot of time. I mean 150 it still is a lot of money um but like i've kind of struggled because it obviously has like a lot of things it's not really asked for anything but i've managed to get him a typical christmas presents or something kind of different as well um and i'm sure he'll like all the presents i've kind of got him things he's wanted which is good obviously um so yeah but, oh my god my shoulders are absolutely killing me because it took us half an hour to walk home again from town with some really heavy bags so yeah 
I'm really tired because it's 4 o'clock as well. But yeah, I managed to have a, a successful shopping trip. I was hoping in my free Prince photos would have arrived today, but they haven't. So hopefully tomorrow I'll be able to film in the vlog. So tomorrow, after work, I'm probably going to be filming a YouTube video because um, I need to get one filmed. I do have a video going up today, which should be a weekly vlog, I believe. Yeah, my weekly vlogs are very long. However, a weekly kind of footage kind of condensed into one video. So it is going to be like a longer vid. I actually did help you know, my grandma find a suitable foundation and also match it to her skin tone as well because she actually did buy a foundation and it was slightly too dark for her so I kind of matched the colour and it was a good shade so you know I'm hoping it'll be fine for her I think it will be oh god I'm so tired I am so excited to take these eyelashes off because as soon as I put them on they literally like you made my eyes you literally made my eyes feel so heavy um, and that can happen with eyelashes sometimes but yeah I had a good spend in boots. Um, to be honest, this year, I don't really know what to ask for. Does anybody else feel the same? Like, you don't know what to ask for? Like, it's just recently been my birthday, so I've got all the clothes I want, all the makeup I want, and whatever else. I do I really want some stony kind of leathery pants, similar to these, but in this type of colour. And I was having a look in River Island, because I do have them online on River Island, but they don't seem to have them in stores, so that's really annoying. I was having a look in Primark as well and you know, they've got so many nice PJ things in but I didn't buy anything for myself so yeah, that's a good achievement. Oh honestly I'm so tired my back is so painful. Yeah, that is one thing I miss about going to college is the, the free massages you used to get because on you know, like a Wednesday evening or whatever or, or like a Tuesday afternoon having a massage before you go home is like the best thing ever. All the joys. Anyway, I'm hopefully going to be seeing Scott in a minute. He, he's still down there. Like, honestly, he's probably talking about you know, what presents he's got me for Christmas. I mean, the Christmas obviously isn't all about the presents and stuff. I'm aware, but obviously, like, it makes it more exciting when you can buy for other people. And I actually prefer giving presents than receiving them. That's probably weird, but yeah, you know, I prefer doing it that way. Shall I show you what t-shirt I got him? I'm going to show you one present I got him actually. Whilst he's still down there. He'll probably be talking for like five hours. Because <laughs> he's a bit of a talker. As some of you probably wear. Also yeah, all the clothes are on there. I think I told you about his parcel earlier on. But I want to show you it in the vlog. He actually went to a Tommy Hilfiger. Um, in case he's outside my room. Hilfiger shop. So I'm... Um, and he tried it on and it it looked really nice but i didn't want to buy it when i was with him so i got it online oh my god this, this is very sealed on like it's very well packaged right oh wow so it's in something else what what i ordered oh my god no way i've actually been sent hair extensions i didn't even realize i thought yeah, this was something for scott but it's not oh my god i've actually been sent hair extensions right it is actually for like a brand i think so i can't actually show you what i've i've got oh my god that is very exciting well i, I really wasn't expecting that anyway um i'll I'll be able to speak to the brand and if I'm allowed to show you what is actually here I'll be able to show you like later in the vlog. Yeah, that's exciting, I wasn't expecting that at all. And now we've got everybody and you've just been giving each other our Christmas sacks back. Yes, this is mine and now I'm giving it back to him because like it's mine. Than me. And then I've actually got his in my drawer as well. Now what? It is actually, it, it lights up as well doesn't it? What have you got in your drawer? <laughs> Stop! And for tea, <laughs> I'm so oh my phone. god, for tea, you're having cottage pie for tea tonight. Oh, are we? Marco's making mince it. Mince again. <laughs> mince, mince, mince. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, there's a running joke about you never know, Scott it comes to my house, all you ever have is like a mince or beef or like some sort of minced beef product. I said uh, to but... my mum, I'm going for tea, and she said, Look at you getting in with the family. <laughs> really? She's feeling a bit. Um... 
I don't know. Some people think I'm moving family. Oh. I'm moving here whenever. <laughs> moving families. And when, whenever yeah, I happy do, families. Whenever I do move out, I think I'd move this end. Oh no! So I'm gonna be away from them. It's all right. Well, my granddad. Oh yes, he's got his camera with him. My granddad told me that he went. He moved from Carlisle to Cockermo for my nana. Really? So See, almost. only you the real ones who love you will move to where you live. Oh my god! If anybody wants to buy it. It's really Anyone been used very a little time. It has Wi Fi on no it. No well, marks on it. it. Wi Fi, yeah. stereos, built in speakers. It extends when the batteries are built in. Built in speakers or built in speakers? It's built in ones. <laughs> this is where the batteries go. Look, very easy to use. If Fujifilm. Fujifilm. Amazing. They're good for brand. beginners, yeah. Lovely. Your eyes. Yeah. You know, um, lots of different settings, record yep. videos, autofocus as well. Oh, um, lots of different jazzy settings. Yeah, oh, you know, very nice. Two hundred pounds retailing for four hundred. Two hundred starting price. Amazing. Your next It'll bid for Christmas. Two ten over there in the corner. Two twenty. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, and also yeah, the birthday balloon is looking very deflated. Oh yeah, and like I also had a candle on oh. in my windowsill, and yeah, the wick is actually melted off. Wait a minute. Are you getting on my yeah, wick? Where's the wick gone? You're getting on my wick. Haha, <laughs> you're funny. It also it's comes with the bag. It's over. What? It also comes with the bag. Zips, oh, yeah. Compartments, things for your batteries, spare batteries, and it goes like this. It's very professional. I think I'm going to take mine to Chris, um, Edinburgh with us. Would you like to buy it off me, Alice? No, I have a camera, thank you, though. It's a spare one. No, it's alright. Maybe you're the one who'll break. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> You've actually gone. It's Edinburgh for Christmas, aren't we? Yeah. Oh. I miss you. I miss you too. Mm. Oh, I've only been couple. a couple of days, but I feel like it's forever. I know, it is. Do you want me to take some leaflets of yours? Oh, yes, please. Do you like my back? He's new Toby's from Prima, Positivity, that's what he is. A positive person. I'd like a t shirt with like someone called Ray on it and put Ray of Sunshine. <laughs> Or uh -huh. just a ray of sunshine. Yeah, okay then. Because I'm the ray. Oh, thank you, Al. Yes, I will have them that one. <laughs> Hi, guys. It's Thursday. Oh, my God. I look so pale and so ill. I literally... I've been working this morning. I came and had my lunch. Um, had the shower and then literally had a two and a half hour, like, sleep. So, I do feel more awake for it. These spots are really annoying me now. I'm just praying they will be gone soon because they look so awful but anyway so i've just made myself a hot chocolate because the reason is is because our water has gone cloudy because the water pipes in our area have been cleaned and i did try a little bit of the water and it tasted really metally so i couldn't really have a glass of water or like a glass of or like a glass of Vimto because it's, it, it would taste really weird so I've made myself a hot the chocolate because the heat is obviously like clean the water in a way so I'm having this so that's great but I mean it's still nice it's just like I like having a water or something because hot drinks they don't it really like quench off thirst does, does anybody else do you know what I mean like if I had a glass of water i'd feel fine after it if i have like a hot chocolate I'd, I'd feel really thirsty after it so that's gonna be fun even our water it currently tastes metally and stuff it's gonna be great me and scott are actually going to be going to our ever first car boot sale um so i'm going to gather a few things to sell um maybe it's gonna be, maybe it's gonna be fun so i'm gonna have to delve into all my wardrobes, all my drawers and stuff and get some things and hopefully be able to sell them on Sunday. So I do have like a good few things from my wardrobe already, like clothes, handbags, stuff like that. Um I think Scott is going to be I think Scott is going to be selling some clothes and stuff and I think his granddad is going to be selling some like old guitars and stuff. Um and Scott is gonna be able to sell them for him. It'll sort of be quite cool, but I'd say it's gonna be it will be like a very early start. Here's everything I've gathered for the uh the car boot sale. It's to be honest, I never realised how much 
it's stuff I would have to sell, but here we are. So like I have like a mix of handbags, um, purses, got jewelry, candles and stuff, a lot of clothes and make like an unused makeup bags and some camera lenses that I've never used and headphones. So to be honest, I do have quite a bit. I've got like some human trainers over there. I'm doing quite well and hopefully I'll be able to sell it all on most of it anyway. Um, so yes, so is Scott is actually going to get a table for when we actually go on Sunday. Yes, he's going to get the table. I've gathered quite a lot of stuff. So like I'm going to ask my mum or dad if they have anything. Um, and if they do, I'll be able to sell that for them as well. I've just come upstairs and yeah, the fairy lights have actually, well, fell off on one part. Oh my God, how annoying. The only bad thing is about doing it if blue tack is, yeah, the battery packs, it will never stay on. But I've, I've been obsessed with these ever since I put them up. How cute are they? Also, a parcel arrived for Scott for Christmas. Basically, what happened was they tried to deliver, even though both me and my dad were at home you have sent it to our next door neighbor's house so i had to go and correct it however i'm going to show you what i've got in i'm going to tell him not to watch this weekly vlog because obviously like it's going to include his christmas presents um also these slippers are literally coming apart oh my god how bad is that i'm desperate need awesome new slippers for christmas so yeah i'm going to show you what i've got in for christmas Oz. I did actually get him. It is kind of like toffee coloured top. As I said, he did try it on in the shop. And this is in a medium, £30. But I think I got a uni day, so like it was 27 And I had to pay for postage, which is like, I don't know, like three, four pounds of postage. But he likes his branded t shirt. And this, oh my god, it, it looks really big. Is this definitely... Wow. Oh my god, why is this so long? Right. Why does this look so big? It looks like a large, but maybe... Yeah, that's because like, it's a longer style t-shirt, but that's like the logo there. Oh, wait. Yeah, the brightness kind of went then. Um, yeah, Tommy Hilfiger clothing is always really good quality, I think. And this is in a medium for reference, but it looks so long. Right. It also start in there, and that's where you know, my pillow is. It, it goes to like almost halfway down the bed. I've literally just got home. It is raining outside. I also have no makeup on my face because I'm actually going out tonight for a meal with my friend and my sister. So I've kind of had to work with no makeup on. It looks very professional when you're a makeup artist, obviously. I had another quiet day today. Um, I even had three people. I mean, it's still very early days, as I keep saying. <laughs> every single week um i don't have a parcel somewhere that i was going to show you oh yeah i guess what arrived you know a free print parcel has finally arrived so i'm going to show you all of the photos i actually ordered um because i love ordering free prints i love how you can order them and then like a couple of days later yeah, they'll arrive so, like i've got a lot of photos in here and it, yeah, they always come in like a really nice kind of little pouch as well. Right, so yeah, the photos I have, I have quite a lot. It, this photo also means Scott. It's Scott with Pudsy Pet. Yeah, that photo makes me laugh. It, want, it move up to Daisy. I just wanted to print them out for the memories pretty much. It's just like if the memories of like my 20th birthday. I don't love myself. I just I like having photos and then in the future, if you ever have kids and stuff, you can kind of show them the photos of us as like a teen, well, you're not really teenagers, but young adults in a way, and like, can be like, oh, you know, is that sound weird? I don't know. Photos, another one. It'd be my sister. It would look nothing I like, as you can tell. I love my makeup. She doesn't like makeup. Like, different hair colours, different face shapes, and everything. Um, that's from my 20th birthday as well, for memories. It'd be my family photo, quite nice. Oh, this photo. You know, look how happy we are. Another one. More photos, I mean, Scott. It is most of them, I mean, Scott, but oh well. It's just collect all the photos I've got. Oh, I remember these photos so well. I mean, Scott again. I'm in my camping. I mean, my mum and my sister. 
Yeah, me and my sister, my dad. And my sister again. Yeah, these are all from Cheltenham and stuff now. But yeah, as you can tell, I've got a lot of them. Finally, look, the glam. I've got a full face of makeup on. I'm actually going to be filming a very important video. So I need to like put my all into this type of video type of thing. I am working with like a certain brand and it's quite a big video to make so i've had to kind of you know, make an effort if my if my makeup and outfit usually i slap on a little bit of makeup and don't really make the effort but i'm all ready to go as you can tell my room is a tip as always but that's my life literally it's gone so dark outside and i'm kind of worried in case you know the lighting is going i'm kind of worried in case the lighting on the video is going to be really dark so i am going to have to make this ring light a lot brighter for the vid because otherwise so that won't be good but yeah i'm wearing a machine top and in my friend black pants and I, i'm gonna get on a roll with the filming now because i really need it to be filmed otherwise i'm most likely get into trouble for the choice of working with brands <laughs> especially in the lead up to christmas you either become very strict with what you've got to include and post and stuff and it's just a lot of stress i'm not gonna lie it's probably more stressful than what i do for a living <laughs> to be honest and that's not an exaggeration that is literally the full truth but yeah i am actually freezing i'm only gonna be shivering this video because i am so cold right now but i want to wear something funky for this video so make sure to watch out for this video i'm sure it'll be uploaded after this vlog maybe you have to wait and see but yeah it's gonna be a good one so don't miss it as you can see hair is all done the video is all filmed and i have my outfit on i have my lovely top on from quiz a belt jeans i'm not gonna wear any heels because i am driving down so i'm probably just gonna wear like converses or something or vans um it's a match of this and i've also got my plumping gloss on again i've curled my hair you're using the you know, lovely hair curlers. Yeah, I'll probably have to sit off in like 10 minutes um, and then find the parking space and stuff. But here yeah, is the makeup. I love it. I'm really happy with the eye makeup as well. I'm happy it was the whole kind of look overall, which I'm I'm glad about, obviously. So yeah, um, I'm going to put it in my jacket on and put some perfume on. Um, and then I might vlog the meal, who knows? If I'm not too awkward, who knows? But yes. Wow. I know, like it's huge. We are driving into the uh, place. It, 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 it's really dark the on the camera. It's the market where we're doing a car boot sale. How exciting! A car boot sale? Yeah, the car boot sale. <laughs> It's so dark. Driving in now, it's like half six in the morning. I've been sat here for ten minutes. Yeah. The queue is right round the roundabout. It literally is. Yeah, the queue like is so long. A good job we came early. I know. Good job we didn't go to Greg's. I know. Yeah, but here we are driving in slowly but surely. We'll get there. Wait till <laughs> you smell it. Oof. Oh. Oh God, it's changed since last time I came. Our stall is all ready. On this time we've got like the home stuff. See if granddad's up yet. No, he's not. Oh. I need to tell him. Hey, look at your bum bag. Hey, look at your bum bags on. I priced something up too Yeah. He's, be he's basically sold. Yeah, this. Yet. Yeah, well. If someone is buying it off him for seven, it, for seven pounds, but you can't take it back now. But, um, but yes, this is like all the home stuff that we're selling and like a, a brand new a kids' jacket and stuff. I'm, I'm hoping you sell this like for ten pounds maybe. Then I just close it's like all my stuff. <laughs> and a bit of Scots and stuff oh, as well. That, yeah, that is creepy. That. <laughs> that is terrifying. They're not really scary like I've got like a lot of clothes. Just open to do, we've got these in look. What are they? Um you can have room in the bloody box, haven't they? A BT. Are you working BT now? <laughs> <laughs> What's in there? It's it phones. All oh, right. They're new, brand new phones then. Ah. Just what I've got is like shoes and stuff. I've got like a jewelry bit. It's like a bit designer stuff. I don't actually use it anymore. I'm hoping I get like 25, 30 for this. Or even 20. At least I'll be happy and that can maybe go with that as well. A bit some bobs. 
a lot of clothes, but it's got like really branded clothes. Uh, Tommy Hilfiger, Adidas, Puma and stuff, some quiz stuff. Oh, what are you doing? Well, yeah, it's the whole kind of setup of the place. It's not, it, it's bad to be honest, and it's not even, it's not even half seven yet, so you want to roll. I've got some camera lenses as well, because a lot of people they buy the camera equipment at these type of places, so yeah, fingers crossed we'll be able to get like a bit for them. It, I think only these ones have been opened once, and then these have been opened, so. Yeah. What size are they? What compatible? Be for like a DSLR camera, on that I've got a digital, a digital something. I don't know the rest of the words, but yeah. Are you excited? Will you get like a photo? Talk you through today's stop. It was a lovely uh, wooden thing. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of handbags and stuff. They're ready and wearing to go oh, now. Okay. All the Thank customers are in. Like I've already made two quid. I've sold two candles. That's that, and you've okay. made thirty-two. We sold your text box. And to walk the stick and someone else it, he sold it for seven and somebody else sold it for 20 well he's selling it for 25 now he put it on his stall instead so what can you do I'll learn. you will learn you will go on the local pubs for a quiz time for our drinks if you actually know you're the owner so like we've kind of got like a table haven't we oh yeah having this lovely like chair here, so nice, yeah. or like a little chair, it's quite funny to be honest, <laughs> if I'm not a drinker, I'm driving, so sensible person, I know, yeah okay, but yeah, if I'm like a quiz night and then they go home and they go to sleep and work in the morning, so that's my life. Yeah, at the moment, I know, hitting there. I'm going Christmas shopping. Yeah, Christmas shopping. On my own. It's better going on your own because you can get stuff for anybody. And you probably find your mum in the shop somewhere. You don't have to hide stuff, do you? Like, you know, you go shopping. But yeah, you've got to do the, the quiz night tonight. I'm very excited. I hope you're glad you are. It was just love. <laughs> oh god, I think I need to end this vlog and start a new weekend vlog tomorrow. So that is my cue to kind of wrap it up a bit, you know. If you guys have enjoyed the weekly vlog, please make sure to leave a thumbs up. You guys seem to have liked last week's weekend vlog, so that's a promising. So if you enjoyed, please make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below if you have enjoyed and subscribe and i'll see you all in my next weekly vlog and the main a main channel video as well so yeah i will see you all very soon bye buddy.